And here at Cannon Mountain Tramway. And we're just getting ready to go up there. My name is Ron. I'll be your conductor on the ride. I'll give you a little history on the tram. New and old, point out a few sights to see. And we ride along. As we leave the Valley Station, looking down to the left of the car in front of the Ski Museum, you're going to view one of the old original tram cars. The dark green one sits right there in front. That was first built in 1937 and 38. It operated until 1980 when it was replaced with the new system that we're riding here today. The area in which you just waited in before you boarded the tram car, the room with the big bay window in it, that's where the old cars used to go in and out. The old tram run right beside of this one. But Cannon was the first site in North America for tramway. And the old cars, they held 24 in the winter, 27 in the summer. These new cars hold 70 in the winter, 80 in the summer. 80 adults, I should say. There's 94 on them. We can put, I've had 125 school kids on so. In the wintertime, it is crowded with the 70 skiers, more so than with the 80 in the summertime. The ride itself is just over a mile long. It has a vertical rise of a little over 2,000 feet. It'll take about six minutes to reach the top. As I mentioned, I'll point out a few things. We have Echo Lake down here to the left. That's a natural lake. It's all spring-fed. Over a million gallons of water flows out of that daily. Now above that, the high peak that you see is Mount Lafayette. That is the highest peak in the Franconia Range with an elevation of 5,249 feet above sea level. It's about 1,000 feet higher than what we are here in Canada. Our elevation is 4,180. To the right of that is Mount Lincoln, also over 5,000 feet. And directly in back of Lafayette, which you do not view on the right or on top, Lafayette does block the view of that's Mount Washington. And Mount Wash has an elevation of 6288, the highest peak in the Northeast. East of the Mississippi and north of the Carolinas. Now in a moment we'll be coming to the halfway point of the ride here at this first tower. And at this tower is where we're going to meet the other car coming down. We always meet here at Tower 1. The reason being we're used to the same tow cable. And that's the small center cable you see out the rear of the car. We're riding on the two outside track cables. So here comes the car now. Give them a big wave. Whoa, that was going back to the Leon. Now as we pass through this tower, you're going to feel the car swing. The reason being for that swing, the angle of those track cables has changed. We've climbed about 1,500 vertical feet from the valley floor with another 500 feet to go.